In this Premiere Pro tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a minimalist cinematic intro. My name is Vegard from the Filmmaking Store, and if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Got a lot of filmmaking and video editing tutorials coming up, so smash that bell! So the first thing I'm going to do is to select the type tool inside of Premiere Pro by clicking here, or you can also click T on your keyboard. Then I'm just going to click in the middle of the video clip right here. And since this is a drone clip from Croatia, let's just write Croatia. Then I'm going to select the text and I'm going to find another font. So the font that I really want to use in this tutorial is Bebas Noi. Just going to click that. And then I'm going to make it in the middle and then center it up just like that. Now you see here that the text tracking is a little bit wide and you can adjust this setting by just clicking this here and just adjust the tracking of the text right here. So I think I'm going to stay with 336 and you can also adjust how big or how small you want the text right here but I'm going to stick with 250 because that seems to look good in this example. Now that we have made our text, I'm just going to make this a little bit longer. So I'm going to aim for around 10 seconds. So we have a little bit of wiggle room and I'm just going to center it out in the clip right here. So right now we just have a simple text that will come onto the screen, but I'm going to make it more interesting. So the first thing I'm going to do, select the text layer and then go to the first frame. And then I'm going to add some animations to this text to make it look even better. So the first thing I'm going to do is to animate with keyframes. So I'm going to go to opacity, click on toggle animation and make sure to be at the beginning of the text. Then I'm going to make this to 0% in opacity. And I think I'm going to use around three seconds to make it fade in and then I'm going to make another keyframe by selecting it into 100. So now it's going to fade into the video but I'm also going to make it fade out in the end of the video right here. So I'm just going to make another keyframe at 100% and then I'm going to scroll to the end of the video and make a keyframe where the opacity is zero. Now I'm going to highlight all of the keyframes that you can see right here. And I'm going to right click, hit Auto Bezier, and that will make the text more fluid, right? You can see in the example right here. After we have done that, we can try to add something more. And I'm going to play a little bit around with the scale of the text. So in the beginning of the text, I'm going to click the toggle animation right there. And I'm going to make it, let's say for six, well, let's try eight, eight seconds into the video. I'm going to make it scale up to 120%. I'm also going to select both keyframes right here, right click and click auto Bezier as well. So now we have the text going slowly into the screen and gets bigger as it goes into eight seconds. Another thing I want to add to this text is some blurriness. And to add some blur to our text, we're going to go to effects and search for Gaussian blur and just drag it onto our text layer. Go back to effect controls and scroll down to the bottom. And we are also going to make a little animation right here. I'm going to click the toggle animation switch and I'm going to set the blurriness to around 40%. I'm going to skip ahead to around three seconds into the video and I'm going to make another keyframe where the blurriness is going away. Unlike the other steps, we're also going to make this a auto Bessier and we got something like this. 
So this is a really easy way to make a cinematic minimalist intro inside of Premiere Pro. If you want to learn more, you can click the next video in the Premiere tutorial playlist. And if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future Premiere Pro tutorials. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.